Hey guys, Janine here with Aradia Fitness. Today we have a lower body workout that we'll be doing. So our little chisel and sculpt class. So all you're gonna need for this class is a mat and a wall, handy. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off by going through a warm up. We're gonna have a set of exercises. We're gonna do those exercises for about 30 seconds. We're gonna do about two rounds of those. And then we're gonna go right into our lower body exercises. So we're gonna do some standing ones. We'll do some focused on the mat. So some mat work, standing exercises to get your body nice and like going, ready for the summer for that beach body. Yeah, so we're gonna start off with some high knees. So here we go. Let's go in three, two, one. High knees are going up, bringing the knees all the way up to the chest. Pump your arms, breathe, keep it going. Remember, if you'd like to go into some knee lifts, we're gonna knee lift here through that exercise, or you can do a quick jog. Just again, get your body pumping, get the blood flowing, knees up. And then for our next exercise, we're gonna go into squats. Toes pointing forward, take it down. Squat, bring it on up. Squeeze those glutes as we come up. Keep breathing, keep going. Good, remember you can slow these down a little bit or you can do little pulses down low. So squeeze the glutes as we come up. Keep it going. All right, we're gonna take it down into our mountain climbers next. Down on your mat, hands down, knees come in. Breathe, remember we can alternate. Knee to opposite elbow, keep it going. You can also go knee to the outside elbow for these if you prefer. Keep your booty low. Good, keep it going. And then hold it there. Hold that plank, breathe, press that mat away. Hold it, hands stacked underneath the shoulders. Breathe and hold. If this becomes too much, drop down to the knees, press the mat away. Same thing here, plank it out. Keep holding, breathe. And then let's repeat it. So let's start out with the mountain climber since we're down. Mountain climb, knees in. Keep breathing. You got it. Keep going. Keep working. We got it. And then go ahead, pop it up, take it down into those squats. Squat down and up. Breathe through it. Good. Squeeze. Glute. As we come up. Keep going. Pulse it down if you prefer, pulse. Nice low pulse here. Sweet. Keep it going. Woo! Remember next, we have those high knees again. Remember, we can jog it out. Take it up, knees up. High knees. Keep it going. Remember, jog it out if you prefer, or do a high knee lift. Going side to side. Keep going. Breathe, We've got about 15 seconds. Keep it going. Keep going. And you are done. Breathe, roll the shoulders back a little bit. Reverse it out. Good. Take it out, you can do that the waist. Drop it down, move the hips. Take a nice big inhale. And exhale, good. Sweep those arms out, lift that chest up. We're going to get a sip of water if you need it before we start our first exercise. All right guys, we're back. So we're gonna start off with our mat exercises. We're gonna take it down to our knees. Hands are gonna go stacked underneath our shoulders. Our first exercise that we're gonna do is our fire hydrants. So fire hydrant, you're gonna take one leg, we're gonna bend at the knee. You're gonna lift up and then lower it right back down. Yeah, so we're gonna start off with one side. We're gonna do a set on one side and then we're gonna do a set on the other side. So, hands underneath the shoulders. Here we go, pick your side. Leg is gonna lift up, knee bent. Take it out, lift and lower. Two, and lower. Three, 
and four, and five, and six, seven, eight, nine, good, keep it going, ten, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 20. Give me five more. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Go ahead. Sit back into your child's pose. Stretch it out before we switch over to the opposite side. All right. Hands back underneath those shoulders. Here we go. Knees about hips width apart. Here we go. Other side. Take it up and down. Two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and twenty. Give me five more. And five, four, three, two, and one. All right, go ahead and sit back into your child's pose. Remember, if you get tired at any point, you can always pause, take a break, get a sip of water. You can also stretch it out a little bit before you continue. Breathe. All right, so our next one, we're gonna stay down onto the mat, hands underneath the shoulders. We're gonna do some leg lifts. So, hands underneath the shoulders. This time, we're gonna extend one leg back. You're going to squeeze your glute and then lower that leg back down so the toes are tapping back behind you. So hands underneath the shoulders. You pick your side. Here we go. Foot taps back. We're going to lift it up and squeeze. Take it up. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine, ten, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and twenty. Give me five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Go ahead and sink back into it. Move those hips side to side. Let's take it right on into the other side. Hands underneath the shoulders. Let's go. Foot back. Tap it. Bring it on up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and twenty. Give me five more. And five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Go ahead and sit back into it. Stretch it out. Take a breather before we switch exercises. Breathe through it. Here we go. Go ahead and take it back on up. We're going to do a little bend and extend. So this time we're going to combine that fire hydrant with a little extension. Hands are going to go underneath the shoulders. We're going to bend the knee, taking it up. You're gonna tap that foot out, lightly tap it on that floor, bring it back in, and reset. On our last one, I'm gonna have you tap your foot down. You're gonna hold it here, then we're gonna lift it up off of the floor and pulse it up in the air, yeah? So that pulse is gonna be like 10 seconds. So underneath the shoulders, here we go, bend and extend it, we're going to 10. So here we go, take it out for one. Bring it in, two. Three, four, five, control it, six, seven, eight, nine, here we go, we're going to hold it out for ten, lift it on up, pulse it for ten seconds, for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, bring it down, shake it out, it should be burning for you. In a good way, breathe. Good, here we go. Let's take it on up. 
Other side, bend and extend, other leg. Here we go. Take it up for one, and two, and three, and four, and five. Remember, we don't wanna just kick and throw our leg out like that. You wanna really tap it and control it. Seven, eight, nine. Here we go. We're gonna hold it out, tap it down, lift it on up, and pulse for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it on down. Shake it out, guys. Breathe. Move those hips side to side. All right. Breathe. Bring it back on up. Hands back underneath those shoulders. We're gonna stay down on the mat. This is our last one down on the mat. Knees apart. We're gonna flex our feet this time. So we're gonna shoot that foot up towards the ceiling. Do a little leg press back and then bring it down. So we're gonna flex the foot like you're gonna kick that ceiling, squeeze that glute and bring it down, yeah? So hands go back underneath the shoulders. Pick your side, here we go. Flex that foot, let's kick it up. Four, one, down, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, and one, two, three, four, last one. I want you to hold it up and just little kicks, pulse it. And bring it down for me, shake it out. Breathe, switch over to the other side. Same thing, last time on our mat. Here we go, flex that foot. Let's do it, kick it up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Give me five more, five, and four, three, two, and one. Hold it up, pulse it, pulse, pulse, pulse. And then bring it on down. Good job. Go ahead, take it back down into that child's pose. Rock those hips out for me, side to side. Press those palms down. Take a nice big inhale and exhale, sinking down into that stretch. Good. Please. All right, hope you've grabbed some water. So we're gonna transition from our floor exercises to our wall exercises. So we are gonna start off by standing next to a piece of wall. So feel free to press your inside hand up against it. Hold on to that wall. We're gonna do some leg lifts, so side leg lifts. When we lift our leg, you're gonna lift and then lower it back down. So try to lift it as high as you can. It doesn't have to be too high. If this is as high as you can go, that's still a leg lift. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pulse it when I tell you, kind of pulse it and slowly bring it down, yeah? So we're gonna start off outside leg, hold on to that piece of wall. You can place your opposite hand on that hip for a little bit of balance. Here we go, let's take it on up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, hold it on up, hold, breathe, 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 it should be burning, breathe. And pulse it, good. And slowly lower it on down, make sure it doesn't drop. And shake it out, good job. Let's go ahead, let's switch over to your opposite side. So opposite side, outside leg, hand on that hip. Let's go ahead, let's take it on up. Take it on up for one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine. Here we go. Hold it up. Hold, hold, hold. Breathe. Pulse it out. Pulse, 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 and slowly bring it down. Shake it on out. Good. All right. So next exercise, we're going into our wall sit. So feet are going to walk out in front of you. You're going to press your back up against that wall. Sit up nice and tall. Sink down into it, it's like a little squat here, squat hold. Here we go, hands can go along the wall, on top of your legs. You can fold your arms if you prefer, whatever works for you. Hands can go out in front as well. So we're gonna hold it here, hold, breathe, sit up nice and tall. Sink down a little bit lower if it feels good. 
Keep going. Toes are pointing forward. Good. Really push through the bottoms of your feet. Keep your chest up. Make sure you're not caving down. Make sure we're sitting up nice and tall when we do this. Hold it. Breathe. Big inhales and exhales. Keep working, guys. I believe in you. Keep going. Last few seconds. Hold, hold, hold. And bring it on up. Shake it on out. Good. All right. So before we go back to our wall sits, we're going to have an inner thigh lift. So we're going to take one leg in front. We're going to turn the knee out. So kind of rotate it to the outside. We're going to lift our foot up off the floor. What you're going to do is you're going to use your inner thigh to lift. And then we're going to lower. So it's going to be a light tap across the floor. Or if you want to make it a little bit harder, just let it hover above the floor. Don't let it tap. Yeah? So using your inner thigh here to lift up. We're using our adductors here to lift. Yeah? What we'll do is we're going to hold it up. We'll pulse it here. And then we'll lower it down. Yeah? Here we go. Hold on to your wall. Take your foot out in front of you. Rotate the knee out. Lift the foot up. Here we go. Take it up. Four, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Hold it up. Hold, hold, hold. Pulse it for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. So that other leg is working as well. You're really pressing the bottom of that foot into that floor, making sure it kind of stabilizes you. So other side. Let's do it. Foot out in front. Knee turned out. Sit up nice and tall. Here we go. Lift that foot. Give me that inner thigh lift. Take it up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold it up. Hold, hold, hold. Let's pulse it out for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Shake it out. Good job. Woo. All right, so we're going to go ahead and take it back to our wall sit. You're going to up your wall sit game here for this next exercise. When we sink down into it, you now have the option of doing a little leg extension. So you'll press your back up against it, extend the legs out. You want to alternate the legs out in front of you. Yeah? So, again, whatever feels good for your body. If the leg extension's not your jam, work on just that regular wall sit. So that basic wall sit, back up against the wall, sinking down into it like you're holding a nice squat. Yeah? So we're going to sink down into it, press that back and booty up against that wall, breathe, hold that wall sit for me and then we'll add the leg extensions. Hold it up, breathe, sink down into it. And then we're gonna start our leg extension. Extend, down, push, down. Work in your quad, so squeeze your quad as you kick that leg out. Remember, push through the bottoms of your feet. Make sure we're not doing this. You don't wanna be like kicking it out. So really push and down, lift and down. Squeeze the quad. Keep it going. Keep working. Good. A few more. Good. Give me one on each side. And then give me that wall sit. Hold it. Breathe for five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Shake it out. All right. We're facing our wall for this next one. We're going to do that little glute lift. So similar to the one we did on the mat. We're going to have our chest up, foot is going to tap, we're going to lift, squeeze your butt cheek, and then lower it down, yeah? So we're going to pick one side, take that leg back, sit up nice and tall, we're going to kick it up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, hold it up for me, hold, hold, breathe, squeeze that butt cheek, squeeze. Squeeze and down. Good. Shake it out. Here we go. Other side. Tap that foot back. Here we go. Go ahead and lift it up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Hold it up. Squeeze. Hold. Hold. Squeeze that glute. Squeeze. 
and lower it down. Good, shake it out. You can stretch it out real quick up while you're up against that wall. Press into that front foot, bend that front knee, shoot that back heel down, stretch it out while we're here. Switch over to your opposite side, bend that front knee, back heel down, press up against that wall. Big inhale and exhale. Good. And then go ahead and bring it back to standing. So we're gonna go ahead and take it back to our mats. We're gonna do a little bit more standing stuff. So just a couple more exercises, then we'll cool it on down, yeah? So we're gonna start out with our side lunges. So what's gonna happen is we're gonna turn our feet forward, so side leg squat for me. So hands go out in front of us. We're gonna bend the knee. When you push into that knee, we're going to extend that leg. So as we lift up, we're going down and we're lifting on up, yeah? So we're gonna do both sides. You're gonna give me 10 on each side. So legs spread apart, toes are pointing forward for this. So we're gonna go ahead, bend and lift. One, down, two, down, three, and four. Good, five, sink down into it, six, seven, Eight, nine, and 10. Good job. Go ahead, shake it out, move the hips out. We're gonna return now to the other side. Let's finish it out, opposite knee. Here we go, bend and lift. Bend and lift. Down and up, and four, and five. Keep going, six and seven. Eight, nine, and 10. Good, shake it out. All right, toes point forward. I want your hands on your hips or out in front of you. We're gonna do a little pulsing squat. So I want you to take it down, low squat, and just pulse, pulse for me. Take it down, breathe. Sink down through the bottoms of the feet, and pulse. Keep it going. be sweating. I am. Keep it going. Breathe. Get low. I want you to hold it here. Hold for five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. All right. Last exercise. Here we go. We're going to do some lunges. So we're going to kind of give ourselves some space. You're going to take one foot. Hands can go on the hips. One foot goes out in front. Back knee. We bend. We push off. And then we switch. Boom, yeah? Yeah, all right, so one foot forward, then we alternate, yeah? Here we go, take it out, push. Make sure you keep your hips squared when you do these. You're pushing. Again, you can lightly tap the back knee if you want, or just let it hover. Keep it going. Breathe, really push, squeeze. Keep it going. Good. Keep working. Yeah. One on each side. Yes. And then backwards lunges. So same thing. This time, instead of going forward, we're just going backwards. Here we go. So same exercise, lunges. One more set. Taking it back. We're going to take it back. Tap back. Bring it in. Tap back. Bring it in. Keep going. Keep breathing. Keep sweating, keep working, Woo. good, keep working, you guys got it, almost there, couple more, one more on each side, and we are done, good job, all right, let's shake everything out, just give me a nice little roll with the shoulders, roll them forward, good, Hinge at the waist, sweep the arms out. Dive the head and chest down. Go ahead and rock those hips out. Breathe through it. Walk those hands in. Take those hands, reach for those ankles. Pull that chest down. Get that nice stretch in those hamstrings. Hold it there. Take those hands, reach for those forearms. Rock it out side to side. Just let your head hang heavy. Breathing through it. And then we're just gonna hold it here in the center. 
Sweep the arms out. Lift that chest up for me. Shake it all out. We're gonna go ahead, have a seat down onto our mats. I want you to extend both legs straight out in front of you. A little hamstring stretch. Make sure you're sitting on your sit bones. Roll the shoulders back and down. Reach as far down as you can. It can be the ankles, maybe the shins, the tops of the feet, whatever feels good. Take a nice big inhale. And on your exhale, sink down into that stretch. Good. And then we're gonna go ahead and roll it on up. You can take one foot to the outside of the hip, or if you're super bendy and flexy, you can place it underneath your hip, whatever works today. Walk it down to those forearms if you like, or you can go ahead and lie flat on your back if that feels good, whatever works for you. Press the knee down, tuck the pelvis, hold it there, and then go ahead and work your body back up. Extend, switch it on out to the other side. Press the knee down. Walk it back to the forearms. Lie down on your back if you need to. Press the knee down, tuck that pelvis, stretch it out. Good. Should feel really good about now. Go ahead and bring it on up. I want you to shake the legs out. Good, we're gonna go ahead and stand it on up. I want you to go ahead and find that wall again. Or if you have super awesome balance, you can use do this without a wall, whatever works. Take one hand, reach for that ankle. You're gonna press the knee down, kick the heel to the butt, hold it there, get a nice little stretch here. And then we're gonna switch it out. Take that hand on that ankle, press the knee down, breathe, get that good quad stretch. Awesome. And then bring it down, we're gonna walk it on back. Give me a nice wide stance, turn the feet out, bend the knees. Good, and then just kind of shift it out side to side. Just move it left and right for me. And then I want you to go ahead and press that left hand down into that thigh, drop that shoulder. And press that thigh with that hand. Good, other side. Right shoulder down in the center, chest opens up to the left. Press that right hand into that thigh. Good. And then bring it back to the center. Press those palms down. Shoot those toes forward. Extend those legs straight. Rock those hips out. Side to side one more time. Sweep those arms out. Lift that chest up. And shake it all out. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed your lower body workout, our chisel and sculpt class with me. So if you have any questions, any questions about form, whatever it may be, just hit us up on Instagram or Facebook or shoot us an email. But thank you for watching and working out with me. Again, I'm Janine with the Radio Fitness. Thanks so much. Have a good one, guys.